and gentlemen, look at Kong, the eighth wonder of the world. In this review, I will be taking a look at the Hallmark Keepsake Ornament of King Kong, based off the 1933 film of the same name. If you are new to the channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button. Let's start off by taking a look at the packaging. Towards the bottom of the front is the name of the ornament, which is King Kong. Above that is a picture of the ornament inside, and next to that is the 1933 King Kong logo, and above the picture is a keepsake logo. There is nothing on the side. Here is the bottom with the barcode. There is nothing on this side either. Turning around to the back at the bottom is the year this was released, which was 2010. Moving up as a little read up, feel free to pause and read. And finally, the top of the box is blank as well. Opening the box up and removing the ornament, it is wrapped in tissue paper to help protect it from getting damaged. And here you have the ornament of the 8th wonder of the world, King Kong. As I mentioned before, the appearance of Kong is based on the classic 1933 film. This particular look and pose is based on the climax of the film in which Kong scales to the top of the Empire State Building. The sculpt work, like is on most keepsake ornaments, is very well done. Taking a closer look at the face is arguably the standout of the entire ornament. He is sculpted roaring and showcases his massive fangs. As tiny as the eyes are, even the paint on them is clean. The inside of the mouth has a black wash over it. Around Kong's wrist, the shackles from which he broke free remain. They are painted in a gunmetal silver to give them that metal look. The top of the Empire State Building looks nothing like it did in the actual film though. I can look past this, as Kong is the reason you would want this ornament, not how accurate the building is. I like how they have Kong's feet grasping onto the ledge. On the bottom is the year this was released, which is nice if you didn't have the box. The fur on Kong turned out really nice in my opinion. There is a subtle wash over the entire body to bring out the detail of the fur. And there you have the Hallmark Keepsake Ornament of King Kong from 2010. Once again, if you're new to this channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button as well as the bell notification bell so you don't miss out on any future videos. If you did enjoy this video, hit that like button. Follow me on social media, links are in the description below. Thanks for watching.